Well, Mark Ruffalo, Tom Holland, move aside there, gentlemen, because <laughs> we got a new head leaker over here just uh, being excited about being in the product and, um, well, I guess getting too excited and confirming internet rumors. So Zendaya herself was like, so it's great to work with Alfred Molina. Oh, yeah. Oh, he's the sweetest guy. Like, oh, is he now? Oh, wow. Well. <laughs> is he now? Guess what? You're, you just confirmed it, so um, this was not 100% confirmed like by anybody working on the film. So now we do, in fact, know, yes, Tobey Maguire was on set there for that specific film and in the vicinity. Molina's in. Jamie Foxx is in. I mean, th look, it's another one of those things. And then literally interviews apart, she said that, I don't know how the hell it fits in, but that they're running from aliens. I took the whole aliens thing purely as a, I'm not entirely sure what's going on in this movie situation. <laughs> and I'm just going to say it's aliens because it's, it's just guys in mocap suits. Mm. That's what I'm taking that as. I'm not taking it as anything. I you, like listen to uh, Elizabeth Olsen interviews and she's like, oh yeah, this thing's here. I have no idea what's going on. It's just like, yeah, they don't. <laughs> yeah. Like, you know, how can you describe what they look like? They look like <laughs> aliens. They look like they're wearing pajamas with dots on them. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going out on a limb and saying Marvel is going to introduce a reign of symbiotes that's going to reign through a wormhole and they're would aliens. Would not surprise me. And it wouldn't surprise me. Can you just imagine? You got multiple live action Spider Man. Tom Hardy's Venom comes in. It's raining symbiotes. Everybody. But he gets a damn black suit. Uh, you sell trillions oh, of dollars. Oh, the, no. You know what it's going to be. Remember how the Venom movie ended? Didn't that uh, rock go into space? Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. I see <laughs> where you're heading with this. On it. I don't Guess like it. <laughs> no! <laughs> when Thanos snapped and Doctor Strange opened the portal, it was at the moment of convergence and that rocket just rains in. Oh, God. Oh, I bet you it's that rocket. I, you know what? That could honestly work, though. Like that'd be a tiny bit of the venom poop on it, and then yeah. Oh, that's I'm, how he gets the suit. It, it's interesting though, because like there's so many rumors that are getting confirmed in offhand ways for this film, and nothing's mm. officially been stated by anybody other than Kevin Feige being like, the multiverse, it's a thing. Oh, okay. Well. Spider-Man 3, and, like, you have, like, um... Some are right, some are wrong. Right. Where's the fun in that? And you have people working on WandaVision that are like, oh, yeah, we have to be in communication with, uh, the, you know, John Watts and what they're doing over at Sony because of crossovers and ideas and make sure nothing steps on the other one. It's like, okay. Like, and only the FBI knows, so we have to keep secret. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, I... Look, whatever is happening in this film, it sounds wild. It sounds great. Like, it's probably not the original third Spider-Man film that Kevin Feige wanted. But in a backwards way, it's a film that I think everybody wanted and now we're going to get because of this whole multiverse mm. thing. So it's like... Eh. So I think with how Feige operates, from well, what I assume how he operates, it's like you can keep the core idea just that you can change everything around it. Like, you can, like... The idea that his identity is out there isn't only ever going to work in one film, like mm -hmm. one way, like one story. That can work in any story. Yeah. And, you know, people always saying, like, oh, you just have Maguire and Garfield come in. That's how you get around the identity thing. And it's like, now they're doing people are going, like, oh, I'm worried they're going to cut the subplot. It's just like, they're doing what you said. Like, let, them, let them go ahead and do it. Right. But that's if they are going to do it that way, which I kind of assume they have to be. If you're going to have three, why not play into that subplot mm. going down? But, eh, we'll find out maybe in our lifetime. Who knows if it's right? Yeah. I, I mean, again, the thing with this whole, um, I don't know what to call it. Like, I, I guess uh, th they are leaked confirmations that, that, that it is what they are. Um, yeah, it yeah. it points to a lot of what we've guessed is already happening in this film, and on one hand, there's a lot of things that seem to fit into interesting places that it's like, oh, fan speculation was probably right on this one, but on the other hand, there's so much 
other stuff that's happening in the other products that maybe maybe not like again we don't know how this could all work together and the thing with connecting all of these is clearly that's like the marvel studios we're mm. working with sony now right like we know that's what it is but a part of me thinks that this is going to get even bigger than most of us are anticipating like you say yeah like I don't know, it just it seems like they're talking about it differently every time we hear about it. Like it's expanded way bigger and more grandiose than we ever thought. And maybe that's just me looking at it differently, but like again, all leaks seem to be turning out to be true and now there's people questioning, you know, it's like, well, how long is this movie gonna be and what are they doing with it and all that. So again It'll be as long as the others. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm expecting it can't be like three hours, but I mean no. you never know. No. You never know. Okay. I can't imagine them doing another three-hour movie for a while. Yeah, no. They seem to probably want to cut them back. And then mm -hmm. there is also, um, I mean, all the chatter we're hearing about whatever the hell is going to happen with, I guess, the future of, um, I guess, Sony's universe. Because, like, they definitely seem to be hinting more and more every time we hear more about it that things are going to be explained in Marvel's movies as well and how it affects Sony. Yeah. So, like, what direction does that go in? Like, do you... <laughs> anything you could think of? Like, I, I, mean, I would have said you build up to Spider Verse. Apparently, no, you just throw everyone right into it. <laughs> yeah. Just like, nah, you just thought you, you knew what these three movies are going to be about, but we didn't know fully. So, this is what's going to happen. Which at the same time, I suppose, is, is not a bad thing. P mm -hmm. Keep everyone on their toes. But I don't know where you go after Spider-Verse. Maybe do a big proper one? Uh... It's like, hey, it's just the three that you know from the, the old ones. But, you know, here's Indian Spider-Man. Here's Spider-Monkey. Uh, right, yeah. I mean, that yeah, might be so, always but, the way. But, but where's 60-year-old Tom McGuire Spider-Man? In the movie before. <laughs> but they want him in the but they want him in the proper one now. All right, you bring him back as Uncle Ben Spider Man. Yes, that's the way you do it. That is the way you do it, though. Um, I don't know. I, I suppose we'll know soon enough. Like Sony's got to confirm something sometime soon. You would hope, maybe. I don't know. They seem to be taking a different approach with this one, but I suppose it's gonna get delayed again. So <laughs> why the hell not? Like, remember when we were supposed to get a look a month ago? Whatever happened to that? <laughs> He said sarcastically because it was never going to happen in the first place. <laughs> yeah, I, I wonder how. I wonder what the hell the Sony heads were thinking because two of them were like, "Look, oh, it's coming soon." Like they they actually said it or not? Eh, true. Interviews, conjecture, I guess. Well, hopefully something soon. Um, look, they're confirming more and more with leaks, so they got to get out ahead of this at some point. So we'll find out. But when's this coming out? It's December, isn't it? Should be December, but. Who, it could change at any moment. Mm. Oh, yeah, that's true. Why even ask for a date when everything's a bit fluid right now, isn't it? 